Okay, we're going to go over the first section of um, Unit 5 for algebra uh, in this little video. So the first thing, um, the, this section is giving you an introduction into um, the XY coordinates and coordinate plane. So <clears throat> hopefully some, most of you have graphed before. But this is the coordinate plane. Okay, we can graph points on this coordinate plane here. The things that you have to know is one, that this is called a coordinate plane, that the x-axis runs horizontally or left to right. Okay, so you have to know that that's the x-axis. The y-axis is vertically or up and down. That's why there's a y right there. Okay, and in the coordinate plane, we can put a bunch of ordered pairs. An ordered pair is going to be two numbers that are in parentheses like that. Okay, so I'm going to graph, or we're going to do a couple examples here of ordered pairs. Each one of those coordinates is an ordered pair. Okay, the first letter is the X, the second letter is the Y. So on our graph, I'm going to put some dash marks here. Okay. I put the one right here and right here to know that these each dash mark represents one. Okay, I could put a 2 there, which means that each dash mark represents a 2. Okay, so for the first coordinate, we have 2, 3. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the right 2, because this first 2 is the x. So we go to the right 2, and then we're going to go up 3, because that's what the y number is. And you would have a dot right there. So this first one, the dot is in red. Second one I'll do in green. Okay, the x coordinate is negative 3. So on the x axis, we're going to go negative 3, which is to the left 3. And the y coordinate is 4, so we're going to go up 4 and put a dot. And then the last one I'm going to do in blue is negative 1, comma negative 2. So we go to the left 1 because the x number is negative 1, and the y number is negative 2, so we go down 2 and get a red dot, or a blue dot there. Okay, so each one of these dots represents an ordered pair. Um, okay, then we also need to know the quadrants. This is something you just have to memorize. So we have our xy plane. Quadrant number one is in the upper right-hand corner, and then we go <coughs> counterclockwise. Quadrant number two is there, quadrant number three is there, and quadrant number four is in the bottom right corner. Okay, and then the last thing from this section, a couple other special words, is this point right here, which would be 0, 0 in blue. That is called the origin. And then lastly, we kind of already went over this, but the y-axis, it's called an axis, y-axis, and then from left to right is the x-axis, okay? So the lines that go up and down there are, are referred to as axes. Okay, so the first section here is really just an introduction into um, graphing. Hopefully you've seen it before, but those are some keywords you have to know, you're going to be quizzed on, and you're going to be tested on.